Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jake, and today I'm going to walk you through a quick demo of how to connect your Nanoleaf Smart Home light panels with Google Home. If you haven't already set up your light panels with the Nanoleaf app, check out the description below. I'll make sure to link a video showing you how. With that said, start by opening the Nanoleaf app to make sure that all the devices you want Google to recognize are set up correctly. Currently, I have a Nanoleaf canvas already configured, as well as two sets of the triangular Aurora panels. I'll leave links to where you can pick up all of these in the description below, as well as my referral link which will get you $10 off your purchase. Once you've confirmed that all the light panels you want are showing up correctly, jump over to the Google Home app. You can see that I have a couple of rooms already set up here with some other lights and Google Home Minis. But to link the light panels from the Nanoleaf app, click on the Add button at the top of the page. It's the little plus sign. Then select Set Up Device. Google gives you the option to set up a new device or one that works with Google. We want to choose the Works with Google option. Next, you'll be prompted to connect Google Home with a known device manager. In our case, that's the Nanoleaf app. So type in Nanoleaf, then click on Nanoleaf Smarter Series when it shows up. At this point, you'll be redirected to the Nanoleaf login screen where you can sign into your account in order to grant Google access to your light panels. So just fill out your username and password here, then click Login, followed by Allow. Once everything is authorized, Google shows us all of the available light panels. To let the Google Assistant know where each light panel set is located, click on them individually and select which home and room they are located in. Repeat this for as many light panel sets as you have to set up. If you don't already have rooms set up within the Google Home app prior to this, you can select one of the standard room names now, or you can create your own unique name. Once all of your Nanoleaf light panels have been assigned to rooms, you'll be returned to the Google Home start screen. Taking a look, we can see that now both the bedroom and the living room have additional devices. And by clicking on each room, we can go inside and see that there are now buttons that correspond to the Nanoleaf Aurora and Canvas sets. With that, your panel should be responsive both to the Google Home app and by using the Google Assistant either through your phone or a smart speaker. I hope this video has been helpful. If you think it has, please let me know in the comments below and by clicking on the like button. Also, please subscribe to my channel and check out some of my other video tutorials as well as product reviews. Otherwise, I'll see you next time.